Hello, Andrew from andrew123.com. How are you? Have uh, you ever wondered what the difference between Facebook and Google Plus is for, uh, for marketing? Well, stick around. I'll, uh, I'll give you some differences uh, straight after this. Okay, you're wondering uh, what the difference between Facebook and Google Plus is for generating leads and sales for your business. Um, I'll go through some pros and cons for each and, and just uh, basically talk your way through it. Uh, you can always visit my blog post where I'll list them off and make it all nice and pretty for you. Um, Facebook, oh, I think it's over 9 billion users. Uh, that's the number one Con, uh, con, uh, pro, sorry, it's a, it's a good thing. But there are some limitations with Facebook. You've got one uh, friends list, that's it. Whereas uh, Google Plus has less users, I'm not certain on the exact number of users, but it's ever increasing. Um, the circles on Google Plus are basically friends lists, and you can have as many as you want, and you can name them whatever you want. That is an extreme advantage of using Google+. Um, you can uh, s put target markets into different circles or friends groups. So you can put real estate agents in, in one circle and, and networkers in another and uh, network marketers in another or you know, plumbers in another and, and use it to target and market uh, your content. Now with Facebook, uh, you've got a friends list and a Facebook page, that's it. Google Plus, you can have a business page also, but uh, I do suggest uh, personal branding. So brand you and not your business. So uh, for example, if you're in real estate and you're working for one company and you brand the company, all that work will go to waste if you move to a different company. But if you portray yourself as an authority or an expert in the real estate industry, then wherever you work, people will seek you out as you, not your business. Same goes with home business and network marketing. Um, brand yourself as the person of authority and, and so forth. So uh, you know, companies come and go, some go out of business, some change their compensation structure and, and, and things happen. So if you have you got followers of you and not followers of the company then then it will be a good thing moving forward. So uh, next um, the ability to search people both in Facebook and Google is possible but uh, personally I find it easier to search for people in Google Plus because Google are the masters of search engines and Google Plus is no different. So you can drill right down to your target market's location and actually add people. Uh, which just leads us to the next point I guess. Uh, as with Facebook you can you can search for whatever location you want as well. But uh, the next advantage of Google Plus is uh, Facebook doesn't like you just blatantly adding people or adding friends or messaging people. Uh, there's been stories of people being shut down, uh, being charged to message people like us. You want to send this person a message? Pay us $15 or a dollar or five dollars, you know, it varies. Whereas in Google Plus you can add as many people as you want uh, I think it limits you at 500 a day, but uh, you'd be doing well to do that. Um, so there's no limitations on that. So uh, basically, I've grown to love Google Plus uh, and using it to, to prospect for sales and leads. Um, like I said, pop over to my website, my blog. Uh, the link will be either here or in the description and see the full breakdown. I mean, there's probably a few more ins and outs than uh, what I've mentioned on this video. So uh, I hope you found value in it. Uh, I hope you found what you're looking for. Uh, and, you know, if it's not there, it'll be on my post. It'll be a lot more thorough. Uh, so pop over there. Um, feel free to share this uh, if you feel the need. And uh, I'll catch you next time. Oh, and before you go, 
Uh, while you're over at my blog, grab a copy of the recurring lead generation formula. Um, very, very good PDF on how to content market to gain leads and sales for your business, no matter what niche you're in. So while you're there, grab a copy of that. It's free. Um, and go from there. Okay? I'll see you on the inside. Bye-bye.